Okay, I am now going to demonstrate saving a movie file in Movavi Video Editor 2023. Okay, the process of saving a movie file in Movavi Video Editor is exporting. That's what it's called. And to do this, we have to click this button here. Export. This is this export button right under the preview window. Click the export button. Okay, now our export prompt box pops up on the screen. And we can see there's several options here on the right, pardon me, on the left of the screen. Several options here on the left. We see save video file, save audio file, save for devices, save for TVs, and upload online. What I want to do for this demonstration is save video file. And we can see MP4 selected. I think that'll be the best for this project because the original clips were MP4. Now, I can see that the appropriate folder, the save to folder here, is already selected. And so that's fine, but I'm going to change the name of my video file. I'm going to change it to uh, video underscore uh, file underscore one. Okay, we can see our quality. Uh, I have it selected as custom. Custom is what I have selected, pardon me. And I'm going to click the advanced button here. Okay. It looks like most of the options that I want are already selected. MPEG-4. Yes, that's what I want for our video card link. Resolution is 1920 by 1080 at 16 by 9. The frame rate is 23.98 frames per second. Uh, that is awesome because that's what I want to stick with and I'm going to leave the bit rate and the audio sample rate alone. I'm just going to leave them be for the sake of this demonstration. Uh, when you start experimenting with software you can may want to select it for yourself but I'm going to leave it there for the time being and I'm going to click OK and now I'm going to click the start button to start the export process of our movie file. Okay, the file, video underscore file underscore one dot mp4 has been saved successfully. And we can see the open output folder is checked. Yes, and I'm going to click OK. Now that the uh, output folder is going to open. And there's our video file saved in the folder. Since it's only about 26 seconds long, how about we watch it? Hey, our pigeons frolicking in snow. This is a northern pintail hen. Hey, that's a little dark eyed junco. That's the uh, slate colored variety that you'll find in eastern areas of North America. It's fairly common in the east of North America. Okay. On a final note, if you want to save just a portion of your video project, say a little snippet of one of the clips, of one of the clips, to do this, you have to secondary mouse, pardon me, not secondary mouse click, you have to just click this arrow with the primary mouse button and click add selection. With these two selection markers, now we can select just a small portion that we want to save as a video file. Okay, so I'm just going to so make that selection here of the northern pintail. We got just a few seconds of the northern pintail in. And now we have to click that arrow again and click export selection. Okay, we can see that the duration is about two seconds. And I'm going to save the title. The saving title is uh, short underscore clip. Uh, I'm just going to call it two seconds. It's about two seconds. Okay, and now I'm going to click advance just to make sure that all the appropriate options are selected. The export settings, 
the air and peg hyphen four 1920 by 1080 23.98 frames per second and the bit rate audio sample rate looks good to me I'm just gonna leave that be and I'm gonna click OK and the folder is selected that's the appropriate folder that's the demo underscore movie folder on the desktop and I'm just now gonna simply click start okay and we can see the open output folder is checked and I'm gonna click OK to open the output folder it is now gonna open the folder has opened okay and now we can see the short underscore clip underscore two second that's its file name and now how about we just watch it I'm gonna click it and we can watch it okay two seconds about two seconds of a northern pintail hen preening your feathers okay that is awesome